Good afternoon. I want to welcome all our students, families, and our staff back to the high school. My name is Mr. Vincent. For those of you who are not familiar with who I am, especially to the class of 2024, our newest Rams. I'm coming to you live from the TV studio. It's been a while since the last time we talked and a lot has occurred. We've seen a pandemic hit us at the early start of the year, which forced us into an unexpected emergency learning in the spring and has lasted through the summer. And as you know, it has made a significant impact on the start of the 2021 academic year. We know that the start of the year is not necessarily what some of you wanted or expected. I think we all can agree that face-to-face -face learning environment is the most productive and effective way to reach our students. However, due to the current situation across the country and around our state, we'll be forced to stay in a remote learning atmosphere. Our ultimate goal is to return to in-person environment once it's safe and we fulfilled some of the requirements that we need to. So please, just to make sure everybody understands, we are doing the absolute best we can to ensure that we will be back up and running for direct instruction. At the current time, we will be out until November 9th. However, we'll be evaluating the situation and communicating to our families and our students on a regular basis. But with that said, I will say that we are excited. We're excited for many different reasons for the start of our school year. First, we miss our kids. We know that they're your children also, but we are, have the honor and, and the trust that you give us to be with them over seven hours a day. We're excited to have them back. We're excited for them to be actively involved in their academics and their social and emotional activities. We're looking forward to building the connectivity and relationships, even if we're in a remote environment. We're excited about where we are due to the fact that last spring left a bad taste in our mouth. We hated seeing key events, athletics canceled, and moving to an all emergency learning plan without a clear date for return and not having the opportunity to connect with these students the way that we could have and should have. It was frustrating for us. And finally, we're excited because we want the opportunity to show both students and our parents that we can be effective and efficient in a remote environment. We listened to you during board meetings, surveys, and one-on-one -on -one meetings. We read the survey data from the students and the families and we know that things must look differently than they did in April and June. We know that there's an expectation for live instruction and a desire for more opportunities to connect with students and classes in a more dynamic way. We know that you want and expect more. I promise you that we will provide and deliver them in a way that we have been working extremely hard on. During the summer, the high school recovery team made up of approximately 13 staff members along with our district recovery team worked very hard on various aspects to make sure that we are up and running in an effective and efficient way. It's important for you, that you understand and to be in a position to start the school year, we want things to look differently. And we want those things to look differently so it benefits our students. We're hoping that we will have the opportunity to show you many different things over the course of the next couple of days. I wanna take a few moments and highlight a few important dates. Our first important date that all students and families are looking forward to is when will you um, have your student schedules? It is our goal that student schedules be released next Friday, September 4th by 3 p.m. They'll be available through the Genesis portal and students will be able to view their, their schedules at that time. To all our parents and students, we understand the need to provide each of you a guidelines and overview on how our instruction will be delivered. This Monday, we'll be presenting a, a remote learning key guidelines for parents and students. This will be presented by myself and our Assistant Superintendent of Curriculum Instruction, Ms. Sandy Small. We'll be sharing out a link to where this um, presentation will take place and we will also be sending it in a blast. Um, student, students and parents will be able to view this and it will be ultimately posted on our website. Again, this Monday will be a presentation for our parents and our students on what remote learning will look like. We know that there's lots of questions. I want you to know that we're, we'll be working on some live sessions with my administrative team. The next live session will be for our freshmen. We understand there's a lot of excitement as being a freshman and there's also some anxiety about being a freshman. On September 1st, we'll be holding a virtual orientation program for our freshmen. Again, this will be sent out in a link. It will be linked on our website. It will be important that all freshmen attend our live session on September 1st, where we will go over what a freshman schedule will look like and how our day will operate. Again, our schedules will be posted on the 4th, but we will walk freshmen through a freshman orientation on September 1st. It is our goal as we get closer to the restart of in-person learning where we will work on having students in small groups at that time come in so that they can transition back to the building prior to the start of the November restart date. But at this time, we will focus on our freshman orientation 
being virtual. Again, we're also gonna make sure that we update our, our high school website. Already on our high school website, you can find materials that relate to remote learning. We'll keep posting relevant information. This presentation will be there. Our parent piece will be there. Our freshman orientation will be there. Again, I know we put a lot of information out, but I just wanted to touch base with our families for a few moments. I know at times we probably, this was a little bit of a, a rambling uh, conversation, but I think it's important that you hear things up front. I know that again, people have questions. Do not hesitate to reach out to myself or any member of my high school administration. Again, one final note, it's important to realize that on September 9th, we will begin our 2020-2021 school year. Um, again, we are excited to have all the Rams back and we look forward to seeing you in person very soon. As we always say here at Heights Sound High School, be safe Rams.